It says there in your pamphlet, no filming, no photography in this room. I say, F that. I didn't put on this asinine hat to not have my children see it in five years on the web. What are they going to talk to their therapist about if you don't film the we do and put we can't have that happen. Somewhere, somewhere, children respect Mike Borja. Only because they haven't seen that. Let's make sure they do. I want you filming every single thing that happens this weekend. I want those phones out. I want them recording. And just remember, when they're recording, your voice is going to be the loudest thing you hear. So when you go back to show it to your mom, and she said, did you have a good time? And he said, yes, I did, Mom. Let me show you. And you have it, and you're filming Jared and Jensen, and you say, oh, God, he's so hot. <laughs> you can hear them very loudly. She's not going to hear them. They'll be like, echo. <laughs> I'm so big out with him. That's what, That's what she's going to hear. Keep that in mind, kids. Film it, shoot it, post it if you're in this room. However, if you go to the photo room, where they take photos, and this is where the irony gets you. No photos. I know the sign says photos. I know you're in there for the picture taking opportunities. However, you are not a paid professional. We have a man who does that. He's tall, he chews gum. He sounds like a He does the photos, he will take the pictures, you do what he says, you keep that phone in your pocket and you smile for the camera, he will make sure you look great. That's the one place you can't take photos. Now, the other thing I must tell you is you're here and you're ready for a great weekend. I'm going to warn you, don't do that. Don't rest on your laurels and enjoy this weekend when you could be worrying about how to pay for next year. <laughs> you feel like you're here for a fun weekend, you're not. This is three days of you contemplating how you're going to scrape together the funds to move closer to the stage next year. So don't, don't be mauled into a sense of complacency. You understand what I'm saying? These things don't pay for themselves, and you know this. You put off a year of college to be here. And get your... So you need to worry about and or figure out how to buy tickets for next year. They're selling them here. That's what you need to do. Now, I understand that sometimes things go awry. Things don't always work out. I mean, <laughs> I know it's shocking news to our Irish kazoo playing brethren, but it does happen. Every now and then something will go wrong, and, and I, I, I'll be honest, the band and I don't care. It's not our contract to give a crap, but somebody here has to care. Somebody here has to at least care, which means by air quotes, pretend to care. And that person who pretends to give a crap about your experience here is Mandy. That woman right there. <laughs>